how easy is it for you to tap into that flow state? Because flow state you can reach in different spheres. Like like you can go into flow state in jujitsu. Of course. You can go into flow state in when you're doing this. How easy is it for you to tap into that now? I uh, very easy. Is it? I and like I think it's just become a, a is it like a muscle? A habit of practice, yeah. So you it's a muscle. You need to work that muscle. You know? Um the more you do it, the easier it becomes. Like, if I have some headphones and paper and a pencil, like, I'm good. Like, you can leave me here for three hours and come back later and there'll be drawings everywhere, you know? It's not easy for everybody to achieve flow state, like this, this, the sense of calmness and creating at the same time. Yeah. Like, uh, this is the movie uh, Soul that I watch with my kids. Uh, have you seen it? Yes, I have seen it. Oh, it's the most beautiful movie because they explain yeah. that flow state so beautifully yeah. man, in the movie. And especially to kids, it's nice for them to see mm. that. But for you to see it and for you to achieve it, it's two totally different things. Yeah. To achieve it is totally, it's very Listen, difficult I for, know, for some. I know I'm lucky to, to be achieve able to that. Do that. Yeah. Like I never frown on the fact that I have this opportunity to make this kind of work and the fact that I am able to make this kind of work and the fact that there are people who like the work, you know, like it was never my goal to make things for people to like it. You know, it, it, when I first started, <sighs> that's the best artistic expression. The, the whole thing was processing thoughts and emotions and <laughs> things I'm seeing and like that, that was it, you know? So yeah. it was, a you know, art for, I suppose the word is catharsis, you know, it's like you, you giving yourself your own form of therapy to release things, you know? And after a while, it was just, you know, people would my friend Goth, um, really good graffiti artist, said to me one day, I see the stuff you're making, don't, you know, he, he asked me to be part of an event that he used to run for um, TFG, uh, one of their sneaker stores. Okay. And he asked me if I would be a part of it. And then I was like, cool. And then the first one I did, and I really enjoyed it. And then this, he asked me, he said to me a second time, do you want to do it? But this time you can draw on the store's storefront window. Cool. And I was like, what do you mean? He's like, you can just go wild. And I was like, okay, cool. And I think at that point, that was a, a real turning point for me because it became something where I realized like, yo, this flow state thing is like real because I painted those windows. Sports scene windows. Not sports scene. Uh, archive. Archive, archive. Archive. Archive in Green Market Square. Crazy. So I painted those windows and there was a, a point in that two hours where I forgot that there were people there. Like I painted... And every now and then somebody would tap me and say, hey, how's it going? And I was like, cool. But there was just this one moment where I was undisturbed for maybe like 15, 20 minutes. And I just, I forgot people were there. Flow state. And I drew on those windows and it was crazy. And yeah, it was, it was really amazing. You enjoyed it. Yeah. I, I, I did like, look, I mean, a lot of people, I think... When I'm doing design work, uh, I don't like when people are watching me. Yeah. You know, so there's always those memes of like, yeah, you know. Somebody watching over your shoulder. You know the meme where they say like the client wants to work with you and then the, you see the two hands, the client's <laughs> hand on your hand. Like, let's design this together. Yeah. You know, I I don't like when I'm being watched while I'm designing things because that that is a very different process. You know, yeah. and sometimes it's a very technical process and you need time to figure those things out. Yeah. But when I'm making the artwork, I couldn't care less if there's a hundred people there or if there's two people there or if nobody's there, yeah. you know, like I'm going to do what 
I came to do. So if I'm painting or drawing or whatever it is, like yeah. I don't mind, and I don't mind sharing that joy with people. And if people want to ask questions, I'm okay to do that. You know, like yeah. so, artist me is almost a different version to yeah. creative director me, yeah. who sits in an agency. But that's such a cool but, opportunity, I think, yeah. to 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 but get paid to express yourself. 